we're here at Rolling Hills Water Park, which is a Washtenaw County park. So with last summer being so hot, they had one of their biggest years ever. Uh, lots of kids, lots of families were out here um, trying to cool off in the water park. Just like a lot of county pools and a lot of rec centers and things like that, um, they cost a lot of money to run. What Rolling Hills wanted to do was obviously reduce their energy costs. A lot of city governments, they see this giant line item on the list of all the money that their pools are costing them. I and a lot of these pools are getting shut down with tight budgets. And one of the biggest costs is the pumps that actually circulate the water in the pools. What they don't realize a lot of times is that you can reduce those energy costs pretty drastically just by changing the amount that your pumps are running. Um, in aquatics, there is a lot of waste that goes on because the motors pumps and motors are oversized. It's kind of like driving down the expressway with your foot on the gas and foot on the brake. It's not good. At Rolling Hills, um, they've installed these variable frequency devices, um, which allow them to control the amount of energy that's going into their pumps. What they found is that, geez, I don't need to run this pump and motor wide open, so let's dial it down. By reducing the motor speed, you're able to basically lower your energy costs. It's kind of like a dimmer switch. You're able to dim it down, let the motor run, and in turn, that's how you get your savings. These variable frequency devices have been around for, for almost 30 years, um, and they've been really successful in industrial settings. At the city of Livonia, we just did a 50 horse motor. They're gonna save about $14,000 a year on one motor, and the payback on that was less than six months. I mean, the big reason that most cities don't use them is that there's a big upfront cost, even though it's gonna save you a lot of money in the, money in the long run. There's a couple 40 horse motors. There's a 60 horse motor out there. When you start looking at the reduction there, that's, it's, it's huge. And that upfront cost is a big barrier for a lot of organizations. And so we were able to work with Washtenaw County to provide that money through a grant from the Michigan Public Service Commission so that they were able to install this. And now they're going to be saving a lot of money every year from here on out. 